Hello everyone, welcome to my Primal Christmas Day 5. Today's video is a bit of a follow-on from yesterday's post. If you didn't see it, it was simply just an image um, and an introduction to the third Primal Blueprint law, which is move frequently at a slow pace. I thought this might need a little bit more discussion around it. This law isn't about going out and taking a long, slow walk. It's more about moving more frequently throughout the day at regular intervals. So I've got five tips on how this can be implemented. Tip number one, park furthest away from the door. It sort of becomes a little game to try and find the closest or the best park at the supermarket. Try parking at the very back and walking just that little bit further. Tip number two, drink water from a glass or cup at your desk. This will not only help with your hydration, but it will mean when the glass is empty, you've got an excuse to get up from your desk and walk to refill it. Tip number three, if you need something, get up and get it yourself. I am very guilty of this. If Cormac is walking through the room or walking into the kitchen, I'll often ask him to bring me something or take something in with him. So I have to make a real effort to just get up off my butt and do it myself. Tip number four, always take the stairs. This sort of goes without saying if you have stairs in your house like we do, but if there is a lift or a stair option in your office building or apartment building, try and always take the stairs. Tip number five, a post-dinner digestion walk. This is something that Cormac and I have been trying to do really regularly even if it's to the end of the street and back, it's nice just to get moving a little bit before you settle in for the night. It's also really good for your digestion. So, if you think about it, all of these things are such minor changes in your day-to-day -day routine that they might not seem like they'll have any effect. But these small changes can really add up over a day, over a week, and if you think about it, over your whole lifetime. These small moments become healthy lifestyle changes that become habitual and hugely beneficial to your health, both physical and mental. I hope this has helped with your understanding of the third primal blueprint law and I hope that you try some of these tips. Thanks for watching.